hand with me? All right, how we doing it? You want to hold my hand? Yeah. Y'all not drunk yet? Because I'm getting drunk. Are you ready? Yeah. You want to do it with me? Yeah. Okay. I want to invite you to the courthouse. <laughs> Sean, man, you got license and paperwork for that night. <laughs> it's funny, but when you're sober, it's a lot easier to identify the ass in the room. I wasn't going to ruin this evening by confronting Ryan about his quotes, but if he's going to hackle me about my cake cutting, game on. Ryan, what's up? What's up with your quote in the uh, Tribune? You doing? Quotes in the newspaper now about me? Talking about I'm not a businesswoman? Speaking down on my business Wait, in Second on, City Hold on, hold on, hold on. Realize where we at. I realize where we at. I want to talk to you about it right now. So what's the problem? The problem is that you're leaving quotes in the Tribune speaking on my business at Second City Inc. Like, are you supporting me or are you hating on me? You feel like I'm hating on you? It looked like that in the paper. Because you obviously told the Tribune something, so tell me how you really feel. I talked to the Tribune about a lot. They asked me a lot about you and being in competition with me when I felt that you were never in competition with me in a tattoo shop in my city. You don't know about tattoos, do you? So you're talking about a quote that says, hey, Ryan, are you in competition with Charmaine? You know I'm not in competition with Charmaine. If you talk about any other shop that is upcoming in my city, I don't see no competition. Besides, what was the article they wrote only a couple of years back? Very pretty, because the that they said in the paper about me was not what you said. You coming at me about me talking to the paper about your business, when well, not even two years ago, you was in the same paper talking about me, you know, trying to incriminate me in a whole criminal situation. Then they have quotes from me talking about, I know that Chicago is known for a lot of violence, but on the other end, it's crazy because Chicago supports the shop so much. I did not give these statements to be in an article about Ryan. Shooting up the shop. It looked like I ratted. I could have looked at the situation as you snitching, and you know, I could have got locked up behind it if it went a whole different way, but it didn't. Yeah. I mean, so you feel in a way it's serious, but like it's not even compared to that. Welcome to the club. So, I mean, you have been there with me as I've had an inspection, as I've gotten fines. It's about the process of getting your stuff together. You think they let me ride? So what I'm Tell me if I got a piece of candy on the ground. You understand what I'm saying? Now you in it. Get your together. I thought I could get this sorted out before anyone knew about it. I just lost Drea. And that's the fourth artist that I done lost. Just left, I made a royal mess of everything, and I'm about to cry my baby shower for all the wrong reasons. But one of the worst parts of it all is that I trusted Ryan to be my friend again, and he obviously still takes me as a joke. I'm not here to sabotage you. I will be here for you if you need me to. You've done enough already. Go f yourself, Ryan. Hey everyone, it's your fave Charmaine, and for more on Black Ink Crew Chicago, subscribe to the VH1 YouTube channel.